Hey guys, um, what is up my ramblers? So, um, it's that time again where um, I'm going to vlog another Disney treat. And I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart that you guys um, really enjoyed what I did with um, the Cozy Cone um, experiment. And I got so much love and support and uh, you guys really encouraged me to keep doing this and, you know, trying new recipes and doing all the treats in the world from Disneyland and whatnot. So um, today I'm going back to Disneyland with my sister and we're going to go to Maurice's treats and I'm going to get all three. I'm going to get the chocolate twist, the strawberry twist, and the cheddar cheese. There really isn't a recipe, like a Disney recipe so far um, when I was looking online, so I'm kind of just going to wing it. So, oh my god! <laughs> ah! You threw me off! No pressure. David Erickson, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, you got me all flustered. Anyway, so baby, does that, does that sound good to you? I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> no, seriously, like no type of recipes just yet online. So I might just wing it. I, I might have a little cheat sheet there, but um, so we'll see how it goes. So wish me luck. Alrighty, we are finally here and we are on our way to Maurice's Treats. If you guys do not know, Maurice's Treats is right next to the Royal Theater. It's a cute little kiosk. And we're gonna get all three, and we're gonna get a boysen apple freeze. Oh my gosh, Bridget, we're, we're getting all three of these. Hi, uh, may I get all three? Chocolate, strawberry, and the apple, uh, apple. the cheddar twist. You got it. Would you like any of the sauces with those? Uh, kind of so Wait, what kind oh, of sauce? Okay. Holy crap. Okay, guys. So this is the, what do you say, the strawberry rose? He said something fancy. Oh my gosh, I haven't had this one yet. And this is the chocolate twist. And I think on top of it is Oreo. And then obviously my favorite, here's the bagel cheddar twist. Okay guys, this is the challenge. All three got strawberry, chocolate, and cheddar, and also the drink. Challenge accepted. You're doing it. Excuse me. Alright, I have never tried this one. <laughs> Definitely I see some strawberry jam or, or strawberry preserve. It looks like it is frosting. But we're gonna do powdered sugar instead. Okay, I just got all. Oh my god, I was like, speak. <laughs> Pizza crust. Oh, I just got the crust. Yeah, that one doesn't look bad. Maybe I can make it taste better. That's very okay, guys. That's a disappointment, actually. Okay. Let's try this one. This one looks good. I mean... Seems like it wouldn't have like, a lot of flavor. It's okay, too. But I taste the Oreo. See, I feel like you need to like melt chocolate so you can dip it in chocolate. It almost looks like brownie. Or like, it is cookie. It is Oreo. That's Oreo. Well, maybe we'll try it with frosting instead. Yeah. I bought frosting for that. And obviously, we all know how this is. Jeez. Oh my god, look at that. This is pretty much just cheese, bread, onion, and cheddar. Mm-hmm. Yay, nay, nay. Okay, my friends. Here are all the ingredients for uh, all three um, pastries and the boys and apple freeze. So I got, oh, that's not part of it, Mr. Dash. What are you doing in there? I'll just put you to the side. Just getting in there like he knows us, whatever. Anyways, so we got Minsk, right? Minced. Minced. <laughs> onion, poppy seeds, sesame seeds, and then we're gonna do uh, real garlic for uh, the seasoning of the bagel, cheddar bagel twist. We got all the cheese. Um, this is, I got frozen apple juice. Um, you just get it at a store, and I'm gonna try to make it look like the drink. And I got um, the strawberry preserve for the strawberry twist. We got the puff pastry stuff again. 
Here's chocolate frosting uh, with Oreos for the chocolate um, twist. Okay, my sister is helping me. Uh, we're just chopping up some nice raw garlic for some flavor. So, <laughs> um, I literally do not have a recipe. I'm literally just doing this whatever feels right to me, whatever comes naturally, I'm gonna do it. So right now we're just prepping our stations. She's chopping up some garlic. I'm gonna have all the seasonings ready to go. I'm guessing 350 or 400? It's 400. 400, preheat the oven. We're gonna, I'm gonna twist the uh, pastry, the puff pastry, and I'm just gonna start glazing. Uh, the desserts one, I'm actually a little bit more nervous because I just, I don't know if I should put it, I should bake it first, then do the preserved stuff, or I put it in while it's cooking or baking. I have no idea. My sister and I are so Italian. We are <laughs> snacking mm, while cooking. We got this beautiful station that my sister's making. Oh, look! It's a hidden Mickey. Oh, look at that. What did you just put in there? That mm -hmm. is melted garlic. Melted garlic, melted butter, <laughs> and garlic, and parsley. Mmm, oh, I'm so excited. Okay. So, here we go, Jack in the Box time. <laughs> okay, so my sister has decided that we're gonna do the cheddar first, and she just took a slice of uh, cheddar cheese from a big cube, and she's just putting it in. We didn't twist them or anything, and we actually cut this in half so they're not going to be as lengthy as the other ones that we see at Marisa's treats um but we're just trying to get, get if we can get the same flavor as we do at uh disneyland and she she just okay so the beauty of the beauty of these pie crusts is that they have openings and so you can kind of like stuff them so that's what we're doing thank you my sister <laughs> You are a genius. I had no idea what you were doing. Oh. Now I get did, it. Yeah. So you guys, I'm so stupid. <laughs> so she had the two. So she cut these in half, and then she rolled them out, and then she twisted them like a little pretty braid. Okay, here's the thing. I can't braid, so thank it God. It was just a twist. I know, but still, that gave me anxiety, but that's okay. Oh, no, okay. All right, right, so now the real challenge is, can I do this? Yeah, you're the next. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, by the way, shout out to my friend Fonzie. My friend Fonzie um, gave me a really hard time that my cones were hideous, but he still loves me. And I just want to say that I'm not trying to be perfect with this. I'm really just having fun, and it's more about the uh, flavor to me than like looks wise. So Fonzie, I love you. <laughs> Fonzie's like a little person. Hey, that's okay. So next we're gonna do the strawberry twist. Um, I just bought some strawberry preserve. Um, this is where I don't know if I should <laughs> put it in the oven when the jam is in there or I bake it without it then put it in. Mm, um, okay, don't they? <laughs> obviously we know which ones I did and obviously we know which ones my sister did. I did not do that one, I so did that one. <laughs> great it's, it's great guys okay so I'm now going to do the fun part which is I'm gonna paint this baby all right oh my god gorgeous look oh god yeah um, I'm really excited to give it some color so I'm gonna do some poppy seeds next is the onion minced 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 hey. Ooh, ooh, exciting this is very exciting <laughs> Um, and then we'll put some sesame, oh, sesame oh seed. My God. <laughs> Let's put some cheddar cheese on this ish. Oh God. I like the bloopers. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> and I'm going to add some Parmesan cheese because I'm Italian and everyone loves Parmesan cheese. <laughs> and these little beauts not yet. are not going to go good. <laughs> We're going to try to make the strawberry ones. Um, on it. Obviously, definitely know it's sometimes strawberry jam or strawberry preserve. I got preserve because I think it's a little bit more, um, it's not, jam is really like chunky. I think this is a little bit more smooth and easy to work with. And um, rather, and hopefully this will taste better than the one at Disneyland. I'm so sorry, Disneyland, it's just, it was really flaky. It had no flavor. I think I'm just gonna do one nice line, so maybe like a scoop. 
in a teaspoon. It'll come out. Come out, my friend. And then just maybe smear it all the way down in one line. Okay, well these are the aftermath of the cheddar twist. They don't really look like the ones at Disneyland, but hopefully they taste like it. And now we're here at this station. We are smearing. Oh, I pierced the toast. Name that movie. You're gonna smear. You're not gonna dribble, you're gonna smear. My sister's smearing the strawberry preserve. And this time for fun, we added some pew chocolate chips. So I took one of the uglier ones and I was like, all right, I'm just gonna try it. I'm actually really surprised how it really does have the same flavor as Marisa's Treats, the uh, cheddar bagel twist. Um, this, all the seasoning really, really helps. So definitely get all three, get the poppy seed, get the sesame and the minced onion. Minsk? Minced. minced. <laughs> Damn it. Um, I wish there was more cheese filling. Um, and I can kind of taste the puff pastry, but other than that, the flavor is really, really good. Okay, the ninja. Say hi, ninja. What do you think? Have you had the uh, cheddar uh, twist? Okay, do you think it kind of tastes like it? Yeah? I mean, it's exactly not the same, but it's kind of there. It's exactly not the same. <laughs> it's exactly not the same? That's what you said. That's what you said. Oh! Smear a nice little glaze. And then when it comes out of the oven, I'm going to do it again, and then I'm going to add some powdered sugar. So. Um, so far, so good with the bagel twist. I was actually a surprise. Um, it's not exactly like them, but like I said, they definitely have the flavor. Now let's see. Um, this I just hope this one comes out more like that and not really flaky. I think the flakiness kind of just threw me off on the pastry. I'm actually more looking for a softer texture. And um, this one is filled. Like I think this one was. <laughs> My sister, 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 me. <laughs> it just smells not that. Oh, yeah. It smells good, though. Okay, mm. last one. So now we're going to do the chocolate one. Um, I really love this frosting. Um, the Ninja and I made brownies uh, for Valentine's Day, and we put this frosting on top, and it was so perfect. It wasn't over powerfully uh, sweet, and it has, it's really creamy. So I'm going to put this inside. With I just um, just did some crumbled up Oreos. It's weird because the Oreo on the pastry at Disneyland didn't have the vanilla. It was just the cookie. So I think with the extra, God bless you. Um, we'll give it more flavor with the uh, frosting inside the Oreo. So here we go. Hopefully the next treat I do for you guys isn't something with Jack in the Box <laughs> because <laughs> it's really giving me heart attacks. This. One. Smells so good. Okay, so here's my spoon. <laughs> um, the ninja did that. So I'm just gonna um, just you know spread them out a little bit, and I'm getting to a point where I'm like, I don't care. I just want to get it done. <laughs> just gonna smear it like I did with the um, strawberry preserve, and just one nice line. It's just all right. So I'm gonna put a little of the Oreo. Bridget's <laughs> I love how you're perfect and mine are like just the... <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna chill in there. Okay, now I'm just getting really irritated. Those are my sisters. And those are mine. Uh, and those are the chocolate ones. Obviously we know what my sister did and what I did. Hey, actually that one's mine. I did that one. That one looks pretty. Yeah, I just did that. Okay, so now I'm just gonna put a little bit of uh, chocolate on top. And then um, I'm gonna add some more cookie crumble and some powdered sugar and my friends, Ramblers. We are done! Literally, Ramblers, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> but um, I'm just gonna put a little bit of boysenberry on the bottom. And I'm just gonna try to smear it up on all four sides, like, I think that's how they have it in the drink. There it is. Here's my little creation. 
I should really say here's mine and my sister's little creation. She did awesome with the twisting. Uh, she helped me definitely a lot with this one. Um, but these definitely already visually look awesome and this will definitely taste good. I tried a little bit of that and it definitely is more like flavorful and, and I like the crust is more of a chewy texture than rather than crunchy. There you go! <laughs> Alright, you gotta try this whipped cream on my cheese one. <laughs> Good job, Liz. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, he's trying the strawberry one. You're doing it again. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, my God, look at that. Look at that, look at that. But good? That's how it should be. <laughs> That's how it should be. What? That is so oh. good. Oh. <laughs> That's how it should be at Marisa Streets. It's gooey. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad I got the chocolate fries. You can taste the Oreo. You can? Yeah. Oh, is it dinner? No, honey. It's my treats. But you've got a whole plate of food. Hold on. Coco. Well, you're, it's nearly you're just going to take bites. Especially you. <laughs> Especially when it comes to the sugar ones. Okay, so this is the um, cheddar one. The garlic, garlic uh, cheddar whatever? Yes, yeah, the big old cheddar twist one, yes. It looks right. Thank you. Yeah. My sister did really good with the twisting. I have no credit for the twisting. That's outstanding. That's really good. Cool. That's perfect. Yeah, I, I got all uh, the seasoning. Okay. Oh my god. Just take bites of these, honey. Okay, so remember, they have the strawberry one and they have the chocolate one. On the chocolate one, they had Oreo on it, so I added some Oreo. But I've never had anything like this at Disneyland. This is how it should be at Disneyland. Coco, it's not for you, Coco oh Bean! My god. <laughs> That's the strawberry one, this looks obviously. Like a crepe. It is kind of like a crepe. That's really good. Oh it's stuck. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> my god. Yeah, there you go. What's this on the side here? Um, it's just whipped cream right, and so Oreo. Yeah. Mm. All right, I'm good with all these. You like them? Is this them? my dinner? No, honey. Oh. Uh-uh. I'm gonna make chicken right now. Are you gonna have chicken with this? The, you can eat this again later, but you need to have like your protein and your veggies. Mm. Okay. Awesome. Everyone loved it. I just took another bite of this. It's pretty dang close. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty dang close. This is the way it should be. Um, strawberry one, whatever, but this one was actually my favorite. I love me some chocolate and pastry. Like, <sighs> anyways, thank you guys for all your support and love and encouragement to do this. I really hope you like this one. Um, I don't really have a link, so literally what I did, I just Googled and just wing it, and I think I winged it pretty well so um stay tuned for next time um i'm thinking of doing uh more like a treat treat like a tigger tail um and then maybe i'll try something more savory like maybe like a yummy dish like at blue bayou like the gumbo or something like that i love you guys whenever you're really upset ladies legit just take a spoon and just go at it Woo! Um, wee ah. i'm sweating um, with a little teaspoon, I just spit. <laughs>